sit down, barely get settled, and here comes the plate. <laughs> and what do they need such a big one for? Is that a hint to put a lot in or what? Well, I guess I should give something. The church must pay its bills too. And these are nice seats we're sitting in. Of course, there's not as nice as the staff sit in. <laughs> Come to think of it, there's a lot of nice things around here. Look at these chandeliers. This place is lit up like an airport. Look at these TV cameras. Is this Ted Turner's house? <laughs> I bet when you become a member here, they really push you to give all the time. This place must be rolling in the dough. God, well, they need my little few measly little dollars anyway. Besides, how do I know where my money's going? Can't be too careful these days. There may be some kind of scam going on around here. <laughs> now, if I use my money, psh, I know where the money's going. Let me think of it. God, you know, I'm just going to not give today, God, and I know you understand, because if I look at this place compared to my living room, I need the money a whole lot more than they do. <laughs> Yes, the offering. What a wonderful time of the service. There's just something about being able to participate in what's going on here. To be a part of funding this great work of God. A very, very large part, I might add. I just amaze myself with my generosity. I just know I could be such an example to others. <laughs> of course, how can I be an example if they don't know what I'm giving? Certainly wouldn't want to tell anyone what I give. Now, that would be a little too obvious. Of course, I don't have to fold my check. I guess I could leave it face up for everybody to see. Uh, or maybe I could put it on the rim. No, it might fall off. Might fall off. That would be perfect. Then the person who picks it up could see it and pass it around to catch up to the plate, then many more would see it and be inspired by me. And if it didn't catch up to the plate in time, the person at the end of the row would have to stand up and call out to the usher. Usher, sir, sir, it's a very large check you dropped. A Winfield Tyler, 7432 William Street, that I'm sure the church could not do without this week. Oh, then the pastor would see all the commotion and call me up front. And make me honorary chairman of the deacons right there in front of everybody oh what a tool it is what a great tool I must be the hand of God your turn oh no the offering I hate this part of the service feed me <laughs> They're going to wonder what I'm going to put in there, and I can't put as much as he did. The people behind me, I bet they're looking over my shoulder just to see how much I'm going to put in. Stop staring at me! <laughs> Okay, calm down. What's the big deal about giving to the Lord? Why am I so paranoid? Just, I'm, I'm just riddled with guilt. Just because I didn't give two years ago, that week I was on vacation. Oh. Okay, God, you caught me red-handed. I didn't separate my trash yesterday. I didn't recycle. Okay. Here, here, just, 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 just take my wallet. Take my wallet. Here, just the whole thing, all my money. Go ahead. Here, take my credit cards too. There's still a few hundred bucks on them. Here, okay. All right, you want to play that game? Here, take my earrings. <laughs> That's for lying to my mother when I was 13. Okay, okay, yeah. 
When I do that, here's my rings. Yeah, my rings. And... <laughs> cover senior prom, I'm sure. Okay. <laughs> okay, and here are my shoes. Go ahead. Here are my shoes. <laughs> That's for lying to my mother when I... <laughs> yes, I went 10 miles over the speed limit on the way over here. I'm sorry. I walk home barefoot on gravel just to prove how sorry I am. Is that enough good? I hate this part of the service. <laughs> Here it is, Lord. It's time. Time that I can show you how much I appreciate you. You know, all in all, I've had a good week. Every night I've gone to bed in a nice warm house. Every day I've had enough to eat. And every morning I've got up to a good warm shower, with the exception of Thursday when Chad got up early. <laughs> but all in all, I've had a lot of good things come my way this week. <coughs> you know, just to think, Lord, just a couple of years ago, I would have been in my office on Sunday morning trying to build my little business. Such a prison. But today, God, in some small, small, tangible way, I have the opportunity to show you that while I know you love me, I love you too, Lord. Lord, this is for you. I forgot my wallet. Sure you did! <laughs>